Boosh! What's up guys? It's Ben back again with another video. One of my favorite things to follow on these apps that keep me up at night is EDC. Tech, travel, pew pew, all of the above. So I figured it's my turn to show you my EDC for 2024. This EDC is going to be the very basic everyday things that I have to have in my pockets every day. But before we get into it, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Ben. I make videos and vlogs about photography and tech. If that's something that you're interested in, hit that subscribe button and consider joining the family. Side note, I wanna thank you guys so much for 500 subscribers. I'm so happy to have seen how far we've grown and I'm super excited to see how far we go from here. Okay, let's go to the toolbox and I'll show you the EDC. <laughs> Welcome to the toolbox. Uh, this is where I normally film my top-down videos, as you can see, and um, I normally don't talk while I'm doing my top-down, so this is gonna be new, uh, unscripted. I don't have a teleprompter in front of me. We're just gonna go through my EDC. So I wanna first state that everything that is in this video is going to be in the description below with uh, links to where you can purchase them or look and see how much they cost. Uh, if I get the prices wrong, let's go ahead get started with what I currently have on this is a ring by a company called Qualo. This ring is a silicone ring. Uh, I wear a silicone ring because I don't want to lose my finger in the line of work that I do. I work with uh, heavy machinery sometimes and I don't want to lose my finger. So I'd rather have the ring break than my finger break off. Uh, moving to the left wrist here, this is my Apple Watch Series 7. This is the 45 millimeter, the bigger one. Currently my watch face is activity rings and uh, time as well as date. Those are the three things that I keep track of the most. I have the regular silicone band because I'm, I'm honestly, I'm too cheap to uh, purchase uh, a fancy schmancy one. On my right wrist here, I have a relationship bracelet that I have with my girlfriend. Uh, it has a magnet on it, so when we hold hands, let, let me let me just show you really quick. <laughs> and then above that, I have a memorial bracelet. Let's go ahead and move on to what I am currently wearing on my head. Uh, you guys may have noticed that I just changed my hat. Uh, that is so that I can make a glorious and yet subtle segue to talk about my merch. Uh, this is a Boosh hat. It is available at my website. Link in the description down below. I usually will wear my merch or I'll wear something else. This is a Demo Ranch hat. You guys probably saw me wearing this in the beginning of the video. I wear this hat all the time. Um, and for continuity's sake, I will put this back on. Let's move on to what I carry in my pockets daily. Starting with gum. I am a uh, avid uh, gum chewer. I've chewed gum forever and um, I really love chewing gum. Unfortunately, because of my Invisalign, I can't chew gum as often as I would like to chew gum, uh, but I keep this pack on me uh, so that if uh, I eat something, um, I can chew it really quick throw the Invisalign back in and uh, keep going. I don't recommend doing that if you have Invisalign. It's just what I do because it's most convenient. Okay, moving on. Keys. Uh, these are my keys held on to usually one of my belt loops by this carabiner here. Um, I have a keychain that I match with my girlfriend. This is a Freedom keychain. I also have an Allen key. I've always needed an Allen key for something. This is actually to a lot of the small rig stuff that I have for my camera. Um, AirTag, keys to my car, and then this key smart key organizer thing or else I would uh, be walking around looking like a janitor. I still kind of do because I wear it on my belt loop, but it's just easy access for me. AirPods. These are the AirPods Pro 2s. I did a complete in-depth video regarding AirPods and the newest refresh and all that stuff with the USB Type-C charging case. If you guys want to watch that video, uh, the link is going to be in the card and at the end of this video. Um, it is in a case, an ESR case. It has magnets on the top so that when you drop it, it won't open as well as magnets on the back so that it will work with MagSafe. I can also magnetize them to things like this toolbox. Next up, 
my wallet. Uh, this is a Ridge wallet. Uh, you guys probably see YouTubers get sponsored by them all the time. Um, I am not one of them. <laughs> I am not sponsored by Ridge at all, um, but I do really like this wallet and I've been using it for about a year now. It's definitely worn. You can see the metal is being exposed. It's all black and definitely used. So um, I recommend getting this wallet, but I am not sponsored by Ridge or affiliated with them in any way yet. Um, a recent addition to the EDC is this belt. This is a leather belt with a uh, big belt buckle on it that talks about my uh, uh, love for the Constitution. <laughs> uh, this is a leather belt. Uh, I got it at Boot Barn. Uh, Callie, my girlfriend, got it for me for Valentine's Day. And um, I did wear a leather belt for a really long time. Uh, this one just took its place because the other one was super worn down and um, I wore it for almost 10 years. So definitely get yourself like a leather belt. Those things last forever. Moving on to my phone. This is the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Uh, this is in the blue color and I did an entire video of this phone and in-depth review of this phone uh, that'll be in the card that comes up here as well as in the end screen of this video. Um, I have a case on it. It's a clear case. I am having some really bad troubles with it. There's a lot of dirt and stuff that comes in the uh, inside of the case here um, and I don't know how because it is sealed so uh, if you guys have any suggestions about it please let me know and uh, the reason why people usually watch these EDC videos or at least one of the reasons why I watch these EDC videos is because of knives uh, this is my current daily carry knife I got for Christmas uh, it replaced my uh, last knife uh, that I had this is the SOG Escape. Uh, it is not spring assisted, but it does have the opener on the side here for your thumb. And it's got the branding right here, serrated on the side here, smooth on this side. It was very sharp out of the box, which is really nice. To close it, you push this right here, closes it right here. You have a seat belt cutter right here, as well as a window breaker on the end. It's a good all around knife. I'll put the link in the description for you. And the final thing that is in my EDC is actually a newcomer. It is this, a multi-tool. This multi-tool has come in handy so many times for me. And I, I always now will recommend people having a multi-tool on them. Uh, this multi-tool is made by Gerber. This is the Gerber Truss or, or Truce, one of the two. Um, it's got everything that a multi-tool has on it um, in a pretty slim profile, actually. Uh, this is an iPhone next to it. It's actually not too bad. And one thing that I really enjoy about this specific model of multi-tool, I don't know about any other multi-tools if they have this or not, um, is the fact that it locks. So if I pull out the saw right here and I pull it out all the way, it locks. I can't close it until I pull down the switch here and the other side here like this, and I can close it. That is great. It's a great safety feature. And, uh, and I will always recommend for someone to carry a multi-tool on them. All right, back to me at the desk. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a like. If you really like this video, hit that subscribe button. Consider joining the family. If you'd like to support the channel, the merch link is in the description. As always, please use discount code BOOSH10 for 10% off at checkout. Thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Stay classy. Bye. It is not spring assisted, which is fine by me. It's got a thumb thing. No.